Welcome back to another episode of This Week with the Clippers. Today we're going to talk about the team's exhaustion. Get this, the Clippers haven't had two days off in a row since December 4th and 5th. They have two more games against Utah on Monday and New York on Wednesday before they will have another pair of days off. That's nearly a month of playing at least every other day, and oftentimes two days in a row. After the Clippers lost to the Toronto Raptors on Saturday, Chris Paul acknowledged just how tough this stretch of the schedule has been. Felt like we ran out of gas before the game even started, he said after the team's 110-98 loss. We were just trying to stay the course. The Clippers have lost four of their last six games. They did have a Merry Christmas, though, beating the Golden State Warriors 100-86. to It was a great win because the Warriors are the top team in the very competitive Western Conference, five games ahead of the sixth-place Clippers. The fact that they're good is a two-for-one because you get a win and they get a loss and it swings them closer to you if they're ahead, said Clippers coach Doc Rivers. The Clippers are two games into a nine-game home stretch. Here's to seeing if they can use this break to gain some footage in the West. I'm Melissa Rowland, reporting for the Los Angeles Times.